All right, Jack, it's Mr. Dan here. I'm going to go over these math problems from Thursday, 521. Um, a little jam board with you in this doc because I don't really have a lot of good paper and pens. Make it easy for you to record a video on my phone or whatnot. So hopefully this will work. And if not, we can try something else out. So we'll go over the first problem. There are 12 apples in a bag. The Santos family really likes apples and bought eight bags. They have eaten 18 apples so far. How many are left? All right. So two-part problem, and obviously working on a lot of those lately. First part is to look at, find out how many apples they had total, right? There was 12 apples in one bag, and they bought eight bags. So we'll do that multiplication problem. I know you were thinking it. We'll pick green for our pen. So come over here to the first part. 12 times eight, right, equals, I'm sure you guessed it already, 96, okay? So that would be how many apples the Santos family bought. <clears throat> Next, look at it, it says they have eaten 18 apples so far, how many are left, okay? Then it's just a subtraction problem because you're figuring out what's left, figuring out that difference, okay? So then you take 96. And you take 18. And then you subtract them. All right, something that we did all year, all before. You know that. Let's see. Hopefully I don't run out of room. All right, looks like I will. So I'm going to put my answer over here. 6 minus 8, you can't do, right? 6 is too small, so we got to borrow from the 9. Cross out the 9, becomes an 8. And now we have 16 minus 8. Which, like I said, put my answer over here. It's going to be an 8. Ah. 8s are harder. 8. And then 8 minus 1, 7. All right, buddy. So we look at our problem. Santos family bought those 96 apples, okay? And they took away, they ate 18, so they had 78 apples left. That should be the first problem, okay, buddy?